Rhode Island's first flashing yellow arrow traffic signal. The Pinpoint News Tracker shows you where it's located on Tioga Avenue in Coventry, right in front of Stop and Shop. The Department of Transportation installed the new light today to improve safety and efficiency. It's part of the Route 3 resurfacing project. Iowa Sioux reporter Susan Campbell is live in the newsroom now with more. Mike, the Department of Transportation hopes that new signal will reduce the number of accidents at that intersection. And if it works, we could see similar signals popping up all across the state. A new flashing yellow arrow turn signal blinks on Route 3 in Coventry. It's the very first signal of its kind in the state. Well, it's, it's a new traffic signal configuration that should help improve safety and congestion. Here's how it works. At a steady red arrow, stop and wait. At a steady yellow arrow, prepare to stop because the signal will be changing. At a flashing yellow arrow, proceed to turn after yielding to oncoming traffic and pedestrians. And at a green arrow, proceed to turn left. Most drivers associate yellow with upcoming changing conditions so that they're, they're instinctively more cautious and they won't uh, just turn left without yielding, yielding to oncoming traffic. Eyewitness News has learned similar signals have already proved to be safer in other states, including New Hampshire, New York, and Wisconsin. On a national level, it's cut the, the amount of left-turning crashes in half. The new signal was installed as part of a $3.5 million resurfacing project. The Department of Transportation plans to install a second flashing yellow arrow in Westerly this summer at the corner of Post Road and Dunn's Corner Road. Live in the newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.